Hello, Brett Fiesta here. Welcome to my new Let's Play. It's finally time. Don't look at the screen. Created and developed by Insomniac Games. Welcome to Let's Play Egg. I love eggs. This egg game has ninjas. It's great. It also has dragons. Welcome to Let's Play Spyro Year of the Dragon. The third Spire game for the PlayStation 1. Uh, and what's especially exciting for me is that I'm actually playing it on an original PlayStation using the original disc uh, that I had as a kid. Also using the original memory cards that I had as a kid, which I have been told should not work anymore. Uh, and yet, here we are. So... I'm very excited to be playing this finally. Um, I My very first project on my YouTube channel was Spyro 1, and it's taken me some time to get to this point, but here we are, and I'm ready to play it. And I can hear you on the other side of the hypertext transfer protocol. But Brent Fiesta, why aren't you playing the Spyro Reignited trilogy? It's so much better. It isn't. That's it. It just isn't. I like the originals, and that's what I'm going to play. I don't want to play the new ones, because I think that it loses the charm of the low-poly aesthetic that we had as... that I had as a kid. Just, like, having to kind of fill in the blanks of, like, you know, all we can see here is very low-poly, low-textured. This is clearly some sort of castle... Um, but just, I don't know, having to mentally fill in the blanks, I really like that. And it's what is nostalgic for me, not this, not the new version. So I'm going to play the old version, and I'm going to enjoy it. The save game is already in use, because maybe I failed a recording earlier. Who knows? Uh, so let's see. Spyro, Hunter, Moneybags, Zoe, Rhinoc. Spyro. All right, let's get into it. An evil plot unfolds. A soul still burns. Here we are in the dragon worlds, the artisan worlds in particular, um, with some eggs. Hello. I don't believe those belong to you. Oh, careful, Nestor. A silent chase occurs. Uh-oh. A powerful villain emerges. A soul still burns. We managed to capture the eggs, your highness. Every last one. Excellent. Maybe you will amount to something after all. Oof. Go guard the tunnels. Stop anyone from coming through. Good thing we have a spy on the inside. Oh, poor guy stuck in a hole. A desperate rescue begins, and a soul still burns. Hello. Where are the eggs? The holes came out on the other side of the dragon worlds. We found some of the eggs, but they were too heavy to carry back. The other side of the world? The forgotten worlds. Spyro, you'll have to go. Nobody else can fit down the holes. Yeah, come on, let's go. Nobody else can fit through the holes. That's what we just said, Hunter. Also, this guy has a fantastic shade of purple right there. Find the eggs and bring them back, Spyro. You're our only chance. You got it. Absolutely. Absolutely. 
I like how a little percussion beat goes in that. The adventure begins. <sighs> this feels good. I feel super good about this. Hello. Just let him go. All right, so here we are. Welcome to Spyro 3. Let's take a look at our guidebook or atlas in this game. The Sunrise Spring Home. Looks like we have 400 gems, uh, of which we have completed 0% of that. And there are five eggs. Eggs are our primary collectible in this game. Don't look at this screen or that screen. Um, so let's get to it. Let me get familiar with the controller. Okay. One thing I really like about this game, uh, and there are a few games that do this. Banjo Tooie is one notable one. Is that all the like power ups that we collected in the last game, we keep. So we can head bash, we can swim, uh, we can climb. I don't know if there's a good place to show that. We can get extra lives. Okay. Just trying to decide whether like the analog stick or the D-pad is going to be our best bet here. Egg. Isabel. Hello, little dragon. Hello, Zoe. So yeah, we have to... Basically, that uh, strange empress, I believe, uh, is trying to take all of the dragon eggs. For what purpose, we have yet to discover, but we cannot allow it because the dragon eggs belong to the dragons which makes sense. It's in the name. So, let us speak to Zoe. Hi, Spyro. Hi. To look left or right, press the L2 or R2 buttons. To quickly center the camera behind you, press the L1 or R1 button. You can look all around by holding the triangle button down. Okay. All right, our mission is to use these buttons to do these things. All right, center, left, right, triangle. Great. We also have our first level here, the Sunny v oh. We're being attacked by a rainbow. So you're the one in charge of rescuing the eggs, huh? Yes. <laughs> How sad. Look here, dragon. If you know what's good for you, you'll turn around and crawl back up that hole you came through. I don't think... Those eggs belong to us now, and I've hidden them in places you'll never find in a thousand years. Besides, even if you could find an egg, our expertly trained armies will dispose of you and take it back. Do I make myself clear? If I find you here again, I am going to be very angry. And you won't like me when I'm angry. We might. Now, okay, thank you for pausing so that we can respond. Do you make my do I make myself clear? No. You said you were hiding the eggs in places we'll never find, such as by the stream out in the open. We already found one. So, uh, good luck with that one. Um so, sorry also that the Empress is mean to you. Sunny Villa. That's going to be our first level, I think. All right. I see money bags over there, our true, like, enemy. May not be a powerful villain, but, like, kind of, actually. Jump from rock to rock. There's Hunter over here. Um, it looks like Moneybags has uh, started engaging in, um, I don't know, capturing, like, Spyro. Hi. My, my, how funny to see you here. Why, I haven't seen you since we defeated Ripto in Avalar. We. <laughs> Well, my business went into a slump after you left, so I came here and struck up a nice deal with the local sorcerers. Lovely woman she is. Seems to be very fond of dragons, too. Yeah, it's definitely very fond of them. She's stolen from us. Uh, a sorceress also, not empress. That's my mistake. Also, yeah, so you switch business from extortion to trafficking? Really good. The sorceress has asked me to guard Sheila the kangaroo. 
I suppose if you had a bit more money, I'd be willing to let her escape. Then you could keep her for a pet or something. All right. Well, we're going to have to uh, take care of that because we, <laughs> we're not going to just let somebody be kidnapped like that. That's a friend in need. Indeed. All right. What do you have to say? Yo, Spyro. Yo. I just found one of those portal thingamajigs that leads to a different world, but you'll have to glide to get across to it. No, I don't know press if we can do the that. Button to jump, then press the X button again while you're in the air to glide. Just follow me. Okay, let's watch Hunter glide. Or I can just do a massive jump. Didn't feel like I was ready. There we are. Excuse me. I saw something shiny in that cave over there. Nope, looks Let's like a barrel. Check it out. You can get there by hovering. To hover, just press the triangle button at the end of your glide. Okay. Right. And jump and hover. Perfect. Oh, I almost forgot. I found this egg. <laughs> How could you forget that? Coltrane. Hello, Coltrane. You know Isabella, but I, you can't. Yeah, you can't be mean to literal babies. Hello, camera. What do you have to say? This is a superfly power-up, Spyro. Whenever you walk through any power-up that looks like this one, it will allow you to fly for a while. Neat. So Superfly is back. Okay, there's lots to collect in here, so I'm not gonna... Well, actually... Ami! I like that name. She's got cute bows and did a cool backflip. Right. I don't believe this is water that's safe to jump in, but... Oh, no, it is. Okay. I guess if it's, like, a dangerous-looking purple, then that would be not safe. Okay. We are just about halfway to saving Sheila. Now we are halfway to saving Sheila. Okay, are we able to climb out of here, or do we... Oh, there's a whirlwind. Great. Well, this is the way we want to go. So... Hello. I guess we do have to get this treasure here. Nice. Oh, I didn't even look at what level this was. Can we see? Yeah. I think it was like Cloud Spires or something like that. We'll take a look. In a short while. I like this, uh, like, kind of foresty area. With these trees here. But you can't, you can't even see the sky. That's neat. Okay. There is a second hunter. Hello. I'm late for a dinner party at the Tiki Lodge, and the portal to my home just stopped working. Oh no. Maybe the portal will reactivate after a few more dragons hatch. Okay, so we need to find ten eggs in order to get this guy to his dinner party. Uh, sorry, Rocky. Well, hello, Liam. Yeah, I get it. Like, being born is kind of rough. It's all downhill from there. Um, so I guess the whole gimmick with, like, the Forgotten Worlds is that because the dragons left, all the magic left with it. Um, except, I guess, for the sorceress. So, um, she wants to bring the magic back, but have it all for herself, it seems. Hi. Your game 
camera is currently in passive mode. This mode requires you to control the camera yourself and moves more slowly. If you like, I can change the game camera to active mode. In active mode, the camera moves much faster. Yeah, sure, why not? Your camera is now in active mode and will move faster. If you don't like it, come back and see me. Or change it yourself by using the options menu. Okay. I see an egg at the bottom of this lake. I would go get it, but I don't want to get my fur all wet. Maybe you could get it. You can dive underwater by pressing the square button when you're on the surface and charge underwater by holding down the square button. Don't tell me what to do. I don't remember whether I liked the active camera in Spyro 2 or whether I went back to passive. I guess we'll, we'll relearn that lesson. We have enough to save Sheila now, which is great. Um, and then some. Hello. Uh, we'll get that in a second. Okay. Bruce. A water dragon. Five out of five. Good job, us. Hello. You need 14 eggs. Here I was, about to go for a nice swim at Shell Beach, and my portal just disappeared right in front of me. If you go find some more of those dragon eggs, I bet this portal will turn on again. Who are we to deny Snappy the Seal's request to go swimming? Like, there's nowhere else in the entire world where he could go swimming. It's just a shame. <sighs> oh. That was an okay jump. I've done better. Yeah, I think the the D-pad, is what I was saying, is better here. How many does this need? 20 eggs. Okay. But nobody's even going to tell us what's behind here. Must be some sort of super secret bonus of some sort. We have 400 gems, right? Hello, Spyro, or Spark Sign. Spyro, I've got a special task for Sparks. Meet me back here later. Okay. Here is a... Oh, here's our hot air balloon. We need to get that. Seems to be a little trapped. Oh, wouldn't be a Spyro playthrough if I wasn't missing a single gem. Like that. Alright, well let's backtrack and find the one thing we're missing. And then go save Sheila. Do a quick runabout. Excuse me. Ow. Excuse me, tree. Okay. See it over here. That's Zoe. Oh, hey. Oh, I want that. I mean, we have to explore the cave anyway, so... Do you think I can just jump directly to it? Yeah. Okay, let's see if it's down here. Oh, that's not going to be correct. Alright, do it right this time. I have to remember it's airplane controls, so everything is reversed. Up is down, and down is up. All right, big jump. Nice. Didn't even have to do a big jump. I just had to get lucky there. Okay. One gem. Where are you? I guess we'll look at what the name of this level is. Cloud Spires. I was right. Good job, me.
Is it underwater? Let's go this direction, because we went like counterclockwise the last time, so maybe we'll see something this way. No. There it is. 400 and 4, or 400 of 400. Wrong preposition there. Level complete. Congratulations. Let's go save Sheila. We could have done it sooner, but it didn't seem like. I'm getting paid a fortune to keep Sheila the kangaroo locked up. <laughs> the pesky animal must have been causing a lot of trouble for that poor sorceress. I suppose I could accidentally let the kangaroo escape if you were to pay me, say, a small fee. If the price is right, a small fee. Yeah, fine. Ah, Spyro, I love your sweet naivete. Your kind-hearted nature might be your downfall someday, but for the time being, it's making me rich. I don't like you. No hard feelings. A soul still burns. Uh, <laughs> I hope you appreciate this favor I'm doing in letting you out. As good of you, mate. No hard feelings, eh? Right. After all, I'm just doing my job. <laughs> good. I reckon you'd be one of them dragons then. Nope. Yeah, name's Spyro. Never thought I'd see one. You dragons used to rule this entire world, you know. Then all of a sudden you left. Poof. Dragons used to live here? Didn't you know? They say it was over a thousand years ago, I think. And they just left? Yeah. And the weird thing is, after they left, all the magic in the world just sort of went with them. I mean, they say this world used to have magic coming out the wazoo. Flying ships, singing forests, wishing stones, you name it. But when the dragons left, it all just dried up. Is that why some of the portals don't work? Yeah, they're starting to fade out too, one by one. Well, I gotta get back home and do some damage control. Come visit any time you like. Well, there's our lore. The adventure continues and the soul still burns. Um, I guess we could have just waited for Sheila to tell us, but I love that there's lore. That's a that's nice and good. Sheila's Alp is actually the first level that we're gonna go to, because um, we did we saved Sheila, so we might as well help her out in clear fixing her Alp. So that's what we will do in the next episode. Uh, thank you very much for joining me for this new Let's Play. I have been Brad Fiesta, and I hope your day is going exactly the way that you want it to. Thank <laughs> you.